Thank you, Jenny. Our second Penn Benenson Courage Award honoree is a young woman whose cell phone and fearlessness may have changed the world. Darnella Frazier, remember that name, filmed the murder of George Floyd by Minneapolis police, and in doing so, she sparked an urgent national and international movement demanding the end to systemic anti-Black racism and police violence. With this award, we recognize her extraordinary courage in bearing witness in a situation of grave personal danger. This is her story. Darnella Frazier didn't set out to change the world on May 25th. That Memorial Day, she was just another teenager, looking after her young cousin as they headed to a nearby store. Step out and face away. She saw a man, hands cuffed behind his back, face down with an officer's knee driving into his neck. She reacted. For over 10 minutes, she held her cell phone steady, bearing witness despite being surrounded by police who could easily have turned their sights on her. She did the only thing in her power, record every second. The next day, she posted it on social media. He's like, please, I can't breathe, I can't breathe, and they did not care. They killed this man. And I was like, I was like five feet away. Darnella's courage came at a personal cost. It is so Within days, the name of George Floyd was known in every home in America. The shocking cell phone video. Of and the, in the death of George Floyd, the unarmed black man. Floyd called for help and finally stopped breathing. His memory and her video sparked a worldwide movement against racism and injustice. Darnella's bravery saw the officers responsible for what she saw fired and facing criminal charges including murder. Her resolve led to passage in the U.S. House of Representatives of the George Floyd Justice and Policing Act and policing reform measures in more than 20 U.S. states. The bill is passed. Darnella Frazier was an ordinary teenager who did an extraordinary thing, a single, selfless, courageous moment that helped transform the course of civil rights across America and inspire calls for justice across the globe. To present the Penn Benenson Courage Award to Ms. Frazier, director, producer, Academy Award-winning screenwriter, and a personal hero of mine, Spike Lee. Hello, everyone. My name is Spike Lee, and it is my honor and my pleasure to present Darnella Frazier. I'm so proud of my sister. She documented the murder of George Floyd, our brother King Floyd, and that footage reverberated around this God's earth and people took to the streets all over this earth, not just the United States of America, and it wasn't just black people either. Everybody took to the streets. My sister, I commend you and you deserve this award. Important word, you're getting the Penn Benison Courage Award. The, the word is courage. I would like to say thank you for honoring me with this Penn Benison Courage Award. Um, I never would imagine out of my whole 17 years of living that this will be me. It was just a lot to take in, but I couldn't say thank you enough for everything that's been coming towards me. Um, and thanks to Mr. 
Lee for presenting this and I appreciate that. And thank you for the Penn Venice and Courage Award. This is the award. If uh, I could take a moment here to take off my Penn America virtual gala host hat and replace it with my Franklin Leonard human being and specifically black human being hat. Darnella, thank you. Thank you for your courage. And I know I am not the only one. Not everybody steps up and takes action, but you did. Thank you. Thank you, Darnella. Thank you, Darnella. Uh, your bravery changed this country. Thank you, Darnella. Thank you, Darnella. Your quick thinking and bravery under immense pressure has made the world safer and more just. Thank you. Thank you to Darnella Frazier for her extraordinary courage. I am so grateful that you all are recognizing her.